In the midst of her advanced pregnancy, Susie was driving her cab through the city when she noticed a homeless man in distress, clearly in need of urgent medical assistance, acting swiftly and without hesitation. She kindly offered to drive him to the nearest hospital, ensuring he received prompt medical care. The following morning, as Susie turned on the news, she was stunned to see this story. My God, Andrew, look, that's the homeless man I told you about, Susie said as she pulled her husband's arm, wanting to direct his attention to the TV. Oh wow, are you serious? This is the guy you dropped off at the hospital, are you sure? He asked, obviously shocked by what he saw. Yeah, that's him. I recognize him. There's no doubt about it, she replied. She waited a few seconds before she continued because she knew her husband wouldn't like what she was about to say. Andrew, I have to go there. I have to help him. What? No, no way, Susie. You should be looking after yourself instead. The baby could come any day now. Susie scoffed and just told him, Well, luckily, I'm capable of making that decision for myself. She got up, dressed, and got in the car, ready to drive to the hospital. Just as she started the car, she saw Andrew leaving the house. She smiled as he walked over to the passenger side and got in and said, You're so stubborn, but I'm not going to let you do this by yourself. On the way there, Andrew asked Susie, Honey, are you sure you don't want to take pregnancy leave? What if the baby comes while you're on the job? Susie just smiled at him and said, Well, I told you then I'll drive myself to the hospital. Now please stop asking me that. You know we need the money. About 20 minutes later, they arrived at the hospital. Susie parked the car very clumsily. She was in a hurry to get inside and see the man who was the only thing she could think of at the moment. She hoped she would arrive in time. Once inside, she skipped the line at the reception desk and asked the woman sitting behind it, Miss, where's that homeless man that was on TV just this morning? The woman behind the counter answered, You're too late. The police have taken him just a few minutes ago. She couldn't believe it. She ran back to the car with her husband to go to the police station and search for him, without caring to consider her own condition. Would they find the homeless man there? In the car, tension brewed. Susie's unwavering determination clashed with Andrew's worries for her safety and their unborn child. Why do you have to do this, Susie? Andrew asked, his worry etched on his face. Susie's gaze remained fixed on the road ahead, because it's the right thing to do, Andrew. I can't just turn my back on someone in need, she firmly replied. Inside the police station, Susie encountered a labyrinth of procedures and regulations. She navigated through a maze of forms, waiting areas, and bureaucratic hurdles, growing increasingly frustrated as minutes turned to hours. Despite the bureaucratic walls that threatened to impede her progress, Susie remained unwavering in her mission to help Tristan. After what felt like an eternity, Susie finally received a glimmer of hope. An officer approached her, informing her she could have a brief moment to see him. Susie's heart raced as she entered the room where Tristan was held. Their encounter was brief but impactful. The words were few, but the connection was undeniable. Their interaction, however, was abruptly cut short as an officer led her away, leaving Susie with more questions than answers about Tristan's situation. Susie left the room with a whirlwind of thoughts. The brief meeting had left her with more questions. Why was he on the news? What had led him to this point? She needed to uncover the truth behind Tristan's arrest. She couldn't ignore the nagging feeling that Tristan was wrongly portrayed in the news. His eyes held a depth of humanity that didn't align with the image of a criminal. Susie was determined to uncover the real story behind his arrest, clear his name, and ensure that justice prevailed. Susie left the station with renewed resolve. She was committed to uncovering the truth, proving his innocence, and giving him a chance at a better life. Susie embarked on a relentless quest for answers about Tristan. She started gathering evidence, searching for any piece of information that could shed light on his life. Her determination led her to explore every avenue available to uncover the truth behind the news report and Tristan's arrest. As she dug deeper, the complexity of the task ahead became apparent. Susie's search led her to social workers who had interacted with Tristan. She delved into public records, painstakingly piecing together clues about his past. Susie used her contacts in the city to gather more information about him. She reached out to individuals who might have insights into his history, hoping to find a breakthrough. As Susie delved deeper into Tristan's case, Andrew's worries grew more intense. He couldn't shake the feeling of impending danger to Susie and their unborn child. 
Andrew tried to persuade Susie to prioritize her health and safety. He pleaded with her to take a step back from her relentless pursuit of Tristan's case. He knew their baby's well-being depended on her, and he couldn't bear to see her risk it all. He feared the toll it might take on their family's future. Despite Andrew's heartfelt pleas and growing concerns, Susie remained unyielding in her pursuit to help Tristan. Her sense of duty and compassion drove her forward, and she couldn't turn her back on someone in need. Susie's relentless pursuit of the truth began to bear fruit. She uncovered bits of information that shed light on Tristan's situation. Fragments of his past and encounters with various individuals started to form a more complete picture. Each revelation fueled her determination to uncover the whole story and ensure justice prevailed. The search led her to a critical clue. She stumbled upon a document that held a vital piece of information about Tristan's past. The new evidence was a game changer, altering Susie's perception of the entire situation. It connected dots she hadn't seen before and provided context to Tristan's life. The missing link filled gaps in the narrative, revealing a story far more complex and compelling than she'd ever imagined. Armed with her newfound findings, Susie embarked on one last determined push to help Tristan. She gathered evidence, connected the dots, and understood the intricacies of his situation. With unwavering resolve, she set out to make a final and forceful appeal on his behalf. Susie presented strong evidence to the authorities, insisting they take immediate action. The confrontation revealed a clash of strong beliefs. It was a battle where principles and determination clashed with bureaucratic resistance. The room became tense as both sides stood firm. Susie's efforts started to pay off, changing Tristan's situation. The authorities, convinced by the evidence and Susie's persistence, began to act. The news broadcast about Tristan's case was finally clarified. It turned out he had been wrongly accused of a crime and the media had exaggerated the story. Susie felt outraged by the injustice he had faced. Susie took it upon herself to prove Tristan's innocence, presenting evidence that showed his arrest was unjustified. Her relentless pursuit of justice paid off when the authorities admitted their mistake. The burden of false accusations lifted and Tristan's name was cleared. This part of the story showed Susie's unwavering determination and its profound impact. Her persistence not only cleared Tristan's name, but also uncovered the truth behind the misleading news report. It demonstrated how perseverance in difficult times can make a significant difference in the lives of those unfairly accused. Susie's determined actions changed Tristan's life for the better. He was now free and deeply grateful. Soon after helping Tristan, Susie gave birth to her child, a symbol of new beginnings and endless possibilities ahead. This event reminded everyone that life is full of hope, renewal, and the enduring strength of love. Susie's decision to assist Tristan not only transformed his life, but also impacted those around him. The story ended with a powerful message about the lasting effect of compassion and determination. It emphasized that even in tough times, one person's commitment to justice and empathy can create significant change and inspire others. As Susie's story concluded, it left readers with a sense of closure and reflected on the enduring legacy of her actions. Her remarkable journey illustrated how kindness can transform lives and leave a lasting impression on those she touched. It highlighted the profound impact of compassion and the belief that each person can make a positive difference in the world. What are your thoughts on this story? Share your opinions in the comments below. Thank you.